amazing. Hath the battle truly ended with such haste? They kept talking about how many were here, so I got my hopes up. I must confess they are dashed. Is it just me? Or have you seemed inordinately strong lately? More so than usual. What do you think is different? Perhaps it is because I am cheating. Hm? Cheating? <laughs> Come on, be serious. Let's see, it has been... five years? For five long years, I have done battle with creatures most foul. In the beginning, these skirmishes merely consisted of prototype Nikes against prototype Rapturers. However, they both evolved in the blink of an eye. Both were enhanced in order to more effectively kill the other. The most obvious byproduct of this evolution for Nikes was their ability to use firearms. Whereas the Raptures became more capable of snuffing out these gun-toting Nikes. Yet, train thine eyes upon mine visage. I wield this. I see. So you're saying this is far from the norm? Precisely. Those creatures shan't ever evolve enough to send me across the river Styx. For all of them to evolve simply to take down a single Nike who wields a blade would be worth neither the time nor effort. As for me, however, I am evolving. I am becoming more adept at rendering raptures asunder with this sword. Those beasts are stuck treading water, whereas I am darting through it like a torpedo. That is why I am so strong. The raptures must be keeping an eye out for you. I am but one lone swordsman. How could I contribute to this war? Don't say that. You're... It's about flipping that thought around. One day, I shall draw this blade across the Queen's throat. That is, if her life is not taken first by someone neither of us knows. The mere thought makes my body quiver with joy. That makes two of us. Hmm... What will you do after? I am unsure. I was born to fight, so my destiny shall be to wield this blade until my dying day. To do what one does best until one shuffles off this mortal coil. Surely such a life is not so bad. Perhaps, but I think I can speak for the others as well, in that we hope you can have another goal in life. Hmm... Well, there is something I've thought about. What's that? Crafting my own alcoholic spirits. Hmm. Don't look at me like I'm some lush worthy of pity. But you are a lush. Huh. Do you remember the seeds I threw aside a few days ago? The ones that ended up sprouting? Yes, I remember. To see new life blooming in the midst of this harsh wasteland was a most shocking revelation to me. There has been much devastation, yet life still breathes within this land. I had forgotten that. Although civilization has collapsed and humanity has disappeared, the land itself is still teeming with life. I know not if we should consider raptures as a form of life, but all we have done is slaughter them indiscriminately. Instead of ending life, I want to create it. That is why I have chosen to become a farmer. A farmer? Yes, a farmer. I want to witness new life being born. I want to see it with my own two eyes. Then turn it into booze. Right, right. <laughs> okay. An existence filled with death and destruction is no life at all. So I... We can start with a small garden. Hmm? Let's make a small garden at the temporary guard post. It's not much, but it'll be a start. A fine proposition indeed. We'll start straight away.